going on YouTube? It's Andrew with Go to College with me. Um, so in this lesson, we're going to uh, learn about static casting, um, uh, which is going to help us go from one data type to another. So if we want to convert something from an integer to a double or vice versa, um, this is a safe way to do it um, without getting un any unwanted results or um, resulting in something called implicit type coercion. I'll explain that in, in a little bit. Uh, but let's let's get started. So first let's define an integer and call it int num1. Give it a value of 1. Keep it simple as usual. Uh, double and we'll call it num2. And give it a value of 2.5. So right off the bat, we'll we'll just do oh, forgot. We'll also do uh, integer num three, and we won't give it a value yet until down here. So num three, we'll give it a value here, and we'll say num one plus num two, and see out. Num three, close it out, and you can see I already ran this before. Uh, I already got the warning down here um, because I ran it right before this video. Um, it's not good. It, it will work, but it's going to spit back a little warning message saying that um, you are converting an integer from double. So we're um, this this double num two is being. Um, converted into an integer and we're losing that um, 0.5 here it's being cut off that's what we call uh, implicit type coercion so we, we don't really want that to happen um, but if we do want to use a double with a uh, integer it is best to use uh, static casting and the way to do that is to simply just type in static underscore cast less than int for integer and wrap it in parentheses now we will no longer get this error it'll still the answer will still be the same um, and 0.5 will still be cut off no matter what it is it could be 0.9 here we'll change this to 0.9 it doesn't matter it doesn't round up or round down it just wax it it just cuts it off so the answer is still three. So say we wanted to do it the other way around and we wanted to um, convert integer uh, num1 into a double. We could simply, let's just erase this because num2 is already a double. And we can come over here and type in static underscore cast plus then double because this is what we are going to um, convert it to. You always type in what you're going to um, cast it to uh, right here and wrap it in parentheses. Oop, I'm sorry. Forgot to change this to a double. I wanted this to be a double because we want to convert this integer into a double. There we go. No errors and 3.9. That's pretty much it for this tutorial. I just wanted to uh, show you guys how to go from one to the other. Um, the same can be done with a uh, float um, also. Uh, there's, I'll provide a link to even more information, but I just wanted to make uh, you guys aware of that um, as we might be getting into it uh, later down the road. Um, but that's it. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks.